Hello. Hi guys and welcome to the Stamp and Scoop show. 170. 170. We don't look that old though. We don't look our age. <laughs> Let's hope not. <laughs> so today we are going to be talking about um, some of our favorites. Like we're, it's, it's time for a new catalog launch to come out with Stampin' Up. New product line will be coming an annual catalog, which is the big one. <laughs> and today and with the good yeah, we, we started pulling out all of our stuff that was going because we didn't want to demonstrate with it yeah. you know that always upsets people when they can't get it and so while we were doing it we decided it's time to share our favorites of the retiring stuff <laughs> and, and it's hard to pick it really was hard to narrow down yeah. actually because there was a lot there was a, a lot. lot of great stuff in here so we have a mega share episode of, I think probably a hundred. I think I would probably say a hundred samples probably. and cards and, and different things to share with you guys. And, and we hope that you really love and enjoy it. And uh, we would like to, we would like to welcome you aboard as well. For those of you, we are broadcasting live, so uh, we are on um, Crafty Stampin' Facebook and YouTube and Stamp with Tammy um, Facebook and YouTube. And we are happy to and see you guys hi. here. I know, definitely hit that subscribe button if you're brand new. We really love newbies and. Hit that like button so that it gets picked up in the algorithm so you, you get more. <laughs> I know, I know, yeah. So while, uh, while you guys are popping on board, welcome. We are going to talk about the giveaways. Um, the giveaway today is one of on our list of favorite <laughs> retiring items, and this one's my one of my favorites, and it is the On the Ocean stamp set and die. And so um, it's a. It was originally a bundle. Now it's available uh, separately, yeah. but it's still available. But it will be going away. And I just have some. I have some <laughs> projects that I'm just going to be terribly sad that I can't make more of because I just love the ship. I loved this so much. So I like that the die you could build. The ship. Yeah, you could build yeah. it. was like a standalone, and it cut out the the things in the stamp set. So in order to enter to win, all you need to do is drop a comment here in this video no matter where you're watching yeah. just make sure it's on the original video yes on any of the four channels and um you can enter a second time by <laughs> <laughs> sharing this video and make sure that you type that you shared in the comments so that we know yeah. um i know we get we we can sometimes see some people that share but sometimes we don't yeah, see them yeah, all yeah. so if you put it in the comments then we can that, what we're doing we'll pull that yeah, yeah we want to make sure that you get credit for that and uh that means we do this on every video, so that means our last <laughs> winner, winner, we got a winner, and congratulations to Deb Schaefer. Congratulations. Deb has won the birthday sparkle kit. Oh, and <laughs> right on cue, there's Paul is that calling. Paul? Yes, you know it is. It's like, I almost want to put him on FaceTime while we're live, but I, <laughs> I won't do that. I, although I do, I do often threaten to do that. <laughs> I won't. That's how fun that is. <laughs> so anyways, congratulations, Deb. We, you can fill out the prize claim form on either Linda or my blog to claim your prize. And uh, while we're going on, we'll talk a little bit about some things that are happening. Uh-oh. Oh. 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 Screen just went black. <laughs> okay, we're back. We're back. Whew. So Paper Pumpkin. So this month that we are subscribing for is the Delicate Wings. Uh, so you got to just subscribe by April 10th. And if you do subscribe with Tammy or myself, you will get a bonus, six-ish, uh, alternate videos from the Paper Pumpkin exclusive video crew, or PBX for short. And <laughs> next, um, there is a new catalog coming out. We mentioned it. <laughs> We're and very you excited want about it. it. If you need a hard copy, if you don't have a demonstrator and you need a hard copy, you can, um, down below, there's our URLs, but yep. they're also in the, the video um, yes. descriptions. You can go to Stamp with Tammy or Crafty Stamp and, and request your catalog from either of us, yeah. and uh, we'll be happy to send you one. They are... Um, they are coming. I know we were able. Uh, so mid mid April they get shipped. Yeah. Um, but we as demonstrators we get the hard copy early. Um, as customers it does take a few more weeks. So if you see demonstrators getting them, don't be upset no. that yours hasn't come yet. It they just, go first. Yeah, the, yeah. Demonstrators obviously get them first because we get to order first. Yeah. It's another perk of being a demonstrator, <laughs> and we no matter what we say on this video and how much we love these things, yep. there is no better value than no. that demonstrator kit. So. Yep. 
And and one and of all the perks that go along with yeah, it. Yeah, and one of those perks is we get to order a month early. Yeah. So that's exciting. And <laughs> um, anyways, if you are a customer of ours, you will be getting a, a yes a co- hard copy in the mail. And this is what we'll be talking about today. There is the last chance list. These are the items that are retiring from both the annual catalog and the mini catalog. There are two separate lists. They are on both of our websites, so you can download those. Um, we are going to be showing you our favorites. But now these will have um, discounts starting on the 9th, which is Tuesday. Tuesday. Um, but things are already selling out. Yes. In so fact, do let's, not let's go talk about that really quickly. Dilly um, oh, dally. We'll get to one. that we'll one. We'll get in to a that minute. one in a minute, but no, one, no, one more. Not it. Product <laughs> sell out. There we there go. There we go. Um, yes. So even some things that were supposed to go on sale April 9th have already got sold out, yes. which means they won't be available on April 9th to go on sale. Um, I know I had previously mentioned if you have, um, products on your list Mm -hmm. that aren't going on sale, you don't want to wait to get them. But now, even if they are on that list, you may want to consider. It's just that, you know, we have no, we don't know when they're going to sell out. We don't, sometimes we can see it on low inventory. And there was a couple of issues, and I know this was a really sad one, um, the Easter lilies that I absolutely loved and did a whole big, I think I did two video classes on it. And I, 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 I apologize to everybody because I feel like I may have been some, <laughs> a little bit of it. My, my love and addiction yeah. to those guys might have had something to do with this, the early sellout. <laughs> but it looks Rain like they park. went on back order uh, and they there's a big delay on them coming in. Oh. And so they'll be coming in after the retiring list, after April 30th. Yeah. So now they're on the discontinued list. And I'm so sorry. I know it kept saying they would come in mid-April, mid-April, Ooh. and then boom, it was Gone. like... Yeah, they. I think they got notified that there's a there's delays in the shipment. So bummer, 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 bummer. Ugh. But but just a you know a note to yeah. you guys. Um, Never and, wait. Yeah. <laughs> in fact, we already pulled out one of the yeah the, one of our favorites that we were gonna share because it sold out yesterday. Yeah. Well, hopefully none of it sold out. <laughs> so it, hopefully, since. yeah. Hopefully, what we have in here hasn't sold out yeah. since. But uh, totally with, possible though. <laughs> with that, uh, one more thing I wanted to bring up is the retiring in colors. Some products in these are already selling out as well yeah so make sure you stock up on your cardstock make sure you stock up on your ink pad refills i think the parakeet party ink refills gone Mm -hmm. um make sure you stock up now don't wait because these these will sell out and they won't wait and you know some things are definitely not going to wait until april 9th (laughs) (laughs) as much as we would like them to yeah all right so with that let's get started with the share because um we have a lot. We have a lot to share with you guys, and I hope that you're super inspired after watching this. <laughs> so we are going to share what, what our favorite must have. And there's no order. And we are, we are, we just, yeah, I'd like to say we're counting down from 10 to 1, but we're there just, no. and you're going to love them all. So I hate to say one's better than the other. No. It's, it's like picking a favorite child. You just can't do it. <laughs> just depends on To which, its face, you say, yes, you're my which favorite. Which one you're with, yeah. right? So... The Charming mm-hmm. Sentiments is to, is retiring, and this is this a fabulous sad. word set. That grows, you can pair this with any floral. You can pair it with any um, any like Anything. nature set and make those those cards good or projects good for any occasion. And it's great to have a good word set like that. And what's cool about this one is it also has a coordinating die called um, Sentiment Silhouettes. The- Die cuts right and they, around the words. And they the actually words. cut out the words perfectly, right? Yeah. So this was this was stamped um, and then cut out with the die so it matches perfectly. Um, I do, we have lots of samples that use it. The word sets yeah. are hard to find the samples on because they're on everything. Yeah. So um, I did want to give that an honorable mention in this little <laughs> piano card, which there's another one on the inside that was mm-hmm. cut out. This was from my pop-up class, a little pop-up piano on the inside. So Charming Sentiments, our honorable mention... And with that, I'm going to have you start because I'm okay. like I I'm need just to plug gonna... some equipment in that right. batteries are dying. Oh, no. All right. <laughs> so I'm just going to pick one that I know she's not uh, showing off unless she has some. So this is Petal Park. Let me put this in here. I didn't bring the stamps. Um, so the Petal Park stamp set is retiring. The matching punch is not. Um, but these are a great um, pair. I mean, I, I, I have so many. I did a class on this, so I have, like, tons and tons this and tons This was, like, totally tons. Linda. This I, the, the paper that went with this, too, was, like, 
I was gaga over it. Um, but I just oh, yeah. loved the the flowers. They're just you can make them any color, and then you could. I'm oh, not gonna. Have, I'm like gonna this. fill up. I like this I, one. Look at the words on this one. Have a window sheet over it. I got two. And this is a. This has got to be a. Yeah, I was gonna say that has to be a fun fold. Yeah. So you fold oh, them up. Oh, that is cool. And they go up. Very cool. Is that a fun one? Oh yeah. I think I need yeah. to make this. Yeah, so I think this, this style. Is kind of, this is going to be coming. Yeah, it's a fun That's style, great. especially if you're doing swaps. It's like, ah! you know, so I, I, I have so many <laughs> that I'm just going to pile them on top of each other. I love, like, just I love this putting card. the flower anywhere, you know, and the, just stamping it and not punching it out. This matches. I do have some duplicates. Um, but so this is Petal Park stamp set. It has a matching punch, but that's staying. The punch stays, the stamp yep. set is going. Yep, but you want to get them both now. Okay, I will jump in next. I'm going to start with, I, there, I, I had, in my choices, I picked three standalone die sets um, that they didn't have matching, didn't have a matching stamp set, but are fabulous <laughs> die sets. They like that lily set, that this one especially is like that lily set. This is called the Peeper florist die set and i had done a class on the paper floors these are gorgeous and they are they were to me these were a hidden gem in yep. the catalog I, I did not even realize they were there all of a sudden one day i'm like hey i, I know i didn't notice that in there yep. and and the next thing you know here i am totally addicted <laughs> making so this is just one card i made and i have i do have we have a cheat sheet on our blogs for the dies there yeah. that's you know just shows that that's a slim line there and then i did a class where we, I did a shadow box. Oh, my little shadow box needs some help. <laughs> oh, just her little flowers are coming down. Unfortunately, but, some of these cards that we demonstrate get beat up I'm, I'm a lot. I'm upside down, there too. Go. There, that's better. Because yeah. I was like, wow, butterflies, defying <laughs> gravity. <laughs> upside down, what is happening here? So that, and then my last one here is from my envelope card box class. That's so cute. And this was, I mean, I just, I loved it. And then I did a... This oh, one. look oh, at that. Oh my gosh, I am a mess. Yeah, they get beat up. But this is also from that Charming Sentiments, our honorable mention right there, that word cut out. And so it's got a little place on the back. You put gift cards in there. And um, we do have photos of all of these on our blogs. Yeah. And ones that, that I've made, I have links to the tutorials for them. Oh, so that is the like... paper florist, um, paper florist dies. Tammy's must have. <laughs> I don't have any for this because I did not eyeball it in the catalog like you did. <laughs> I was like, oh, no, it's fine. That's nothing. That's nothing big. Uh, so she thought. <laughs> no, you're sorry. So she oh, thought. Well. All right. So my next one is, this one you guys have seen me do before, is the Country Bouquet. Stamp set and punch are both retiring. So you do want to get that. So here I, I have, like, another one that I have a bazillion of. Because it was just the best. It was, a, it was a great set. You know, and yep, it hit the Valentine's Day button, but it really could, you and know, beyond. any romance, to Valentine's love. Day and beyond. Yeah. This was um, a lot of swap cards that I got from this because everyone else loved it. This is another one of those, I think. So this one just flips open in the middle versus... I love it. I love yeah. it. I think All right, I'm, so I have to start stacking them up. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to need to make one of those. <laughs> I'm going to need to borrow one of those. There we go. And we should also note, um, this is not in our presentation today, but um, vellum, and it's gone. It's gone. It's sold out. I, I'm devastated. Okay. <laughs> Everyone needs to write in and be like, we want I back. need that back. Bring Vellum back. It's the one awesome thing about online exclusives. They could just bring right, stuff back. Right, right, right. As soon as they brought back circle punches, I was like, oh, oh, mm -hmm. I now know how to get, get what I want. Mm -hmm. So these are all uh, my country bouquet selection of cards, which is one of my favorites, as you can see. <laughs> And for those of you popping on late, everything we're sharing today are um, all 
of our favorite products that are retiring from either the annual catalog or the mini catalog. Mm. The yep. Stampin' Up! annual catalog or the Stampin' Up! mini catalog. They will be available if they stay. If they don't sell out before April 30th, April 30th is the hard deadline and they will be gone after that. <laughs> they will be gone forever. So the next die set, it did have, this did have a stamp set at one time that, that, yes. that coordinated with it. And this is a And then it came color. back all on its own. And then the, the die, yeah, the die came back, this little pine cone. So these layer, oh, you can't see this. <laughs> it's nice, right? That's really nice. All right. She's so, so mean. I'm so mean. I'm like popping it out. And they're like, yeah, yeah we, we can't see any of it. doesn't matter what you pull out there. Yeah. So they, they like layer. And I'll just show you an example here. So we've got like one piece. Here would be the darker evergreen and then the, the lighter on top of that. And the same with the, the pine cones. It was a beautiful, beautiful die set. And I'm really kind of bummed out that it's missed, that's going away. Mm. This is the, um, sorry, I don't have beautiful cards like Linda does that <laughs> explain what everything is. Christmas pine cone dies. So um, that was one right there. Really pretty. And I know that it's, we're, we're getting into the spring season. So yeah, like, yeah. Christmas, Chris, uh, yeah. I, I, I'm still recovering from last Christmas. I don't know if I can go there yet. But... <laughs> It is going, and it is just a beautiful die oh, set. Oh, that's so this pretty. This one's like a floating, a floating <gasps> card. I love so that. I love floaty, the black with it. A little floaty uh, piece in there. And then I did a whole um, line of photo cards, Christmas photo cards, because, you know, we all, everybody loves to do photo cards, right? So these are a whole line that I did using that die, and I made photo cards out of all of them. And then this one... It's a oh, that's double cool. Z with the photo on the inside. That's so the, cool. And then the last one is like just a classic, simple. Ooh, you know, I like, like that. The, the, white uh, on white. Yep. Nice. Yeah. And so that was the Christmas pine cone dies. Oh. Yeah, see, some of these make me sad. I'm like, oh, <laughs> I didn't get that one. Maybe I should have. <laughs> All right. So another one that I have. A, I'm doing the ones that I have like. A bazillion of. All right, so this is color and contour, and the and this dye, one's a pretty old one. This one's yeah. been around for a long time. The, the, this is when the dyes did not have the same names, names. and it's just left me. I forget the name. Uh, it's, it's like scallops. I think scallop, it's scallop contour, contour dyes, something like that. Which was a die set I use all the time. Yeah. So you you'll see that dyes this on, this. on the background yeah. here, and that that's a just that die alone is worth it because yeah. it's like layering like um, labels like those yeah. dies. I love a good layering set. Yeah. This again, another one I have a bazillion of. Uh, what good reason? Yeah. I loved this flower. This one was mine. From our swap. Okay, we're just going to top of each other. Like, look how fun that is. I love it. I love uh, it. Your monotone. My Terry's like, I use those dyes all the time, right? Oh, yeah. Right? I know there's several like that. I'm like, what, 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 why are they leaving? Like, what? No, no, no. This one, I know. This one's been around like, for a while, too. Yeah. So... And the last die set that I, I standalone die set that I, I felt like needed to be spotlighted in the retiring collection is this one. I love that. This set. one, and if you were not sure about the cracker and treat box die, I am going to here. Hold on, I got some boring ones. Let's let, let compare okay. it to hers. So I just got a cute. There's nothing boring they're about boring. that. They're 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 standalone. Hold on. I'm like Tammy, <laughs> so. And then this was used with uh, some uh, paper pumpkin. So, so these are these are the simple stand by themselves. Now see what Tammy does with. <laughs> okay, you know what I'm saying. We got little snowmen. That's why I said mine were and, boring. <laughs> and I, I cut them in half and made little caps. Right. That's so cute. So you can fill it up with candy or trinkets or whatever. And I just cut the bottom off and sealed it there so it didn't have the two sides. It just has the one. So he's got a little cap on. So stinking so cute. That was a cute. Class, class I did. And um, I also did a whole, last year I did a class on 
I love um, that. The Cracker Treat Die Boxes. <laughs> um, these are called boxes. The actual Cracker Treat Box is called a, a box. And then I made gift boxes to put them in so you could gift them. <laughs> box within a box. You know what I'm saying. <laughs> Anyways, um, so this was the Countryside. Now, the Countryside is staying. is staying. And the Designer Series paper is staying, yeah, too. Which paper is and the dies. I've heard of. So that's cool. But yeah. the Cracker and Treat Box is not. And this one is right up there with yep. my my faves, right up there on the list. Okay. So here's another one. This is Circle Sayings. And this is bundled with the two and three eight circle punch. The punch is not going, but the stamp set is. So I have tons. Another one. Which is a great Aww. general set yeah. that it's you always... could use for multiple occasions. I love it. Um, I love the surf ones. And there's I have tons of birthday cakes because who doesn't need a birthday cake? Yeah, right? You know, like, uh, I feel like birthdays and sympathies are what I need the most. Yeah. And then the greetings like the thank you and the warm hello. Um, have fun font. This, you know, this. I love that. That's my little, little anchor on it. Pretty cute. I combined it because you can see, I don't know if you can see the shells and whatever, which are on here. So you just use the shells. It's like uh, fun. This, I like this guy. Like, oh, that's Whoop, fun. Peekaboo. Peekaboo. That's super fun. Yeah. And then I think, oh yeah, so here we go. There it goes. And and then, oh, there we go. Oh, I like this. I need that. I need to borrow, <laughs> need to borrow that one. <laughs> I might need to borrow a couple of them, but I definitely <laughs> need to borrow this She's, one. This is fantastic. Isn't that cute? Yeah. So this was just your ultimate. Dwayne, I just totally stole that right away. <laughs> like, Versatile boom. set. So circle sayings and the, the circle was... punch, but that's staying around. But while you're at it, might as well get both. So next on my list is a stamp set. It's not a bundle, it's just a stamp set. And it's called Everyday Thanks. And this is one, the first time I looked at it, I said, oh, it's cute. cute. I don't know that what I would use that for. And then I started playing with it. And then I thought, oh my gosh, what wouldn't you use this for? <laughs> so many things. But what I started using it for was, um, it was a teacher appreciation class. We were doing a back to school. Oh, I uh, love that. I mean, uh, a fall blog hop, and I was thinking back to school. And the apples are from Apple Harvest, which is another also retiring retiring. stamp set. So that was a card. Oh, I thought you and snuck then that this in. is another. <laughs> this is another retiring stamp set called Give It a Whirl. Uh, no, the yeah, it's it, the die. Give it a whirl. Yeah, sorry, die. Yeah. Thank you for yeah. correcting me. And um, it's the spinner here. Right, yeah. so these are all on the spinner. The backpack is from uh, another retiring stamp set next destiny, destination. Something destination. So anyways, a lot of retiring stuff on that one. Yeah. And then I made these little, um, they're uh, gift card holder boxes. Oh, so cute. So the boxes, right? And you open it up and then you put a little gift card in here. So then I thought, well, you know, you want to give the teacher, like they, they send you the list of what they need before. Oh. The, so give them a little Amazon card and then they can buy the stuff that they need, right? I just thought that was cute. And then I made a window, a window box oh. out of one of them. And then, sorry. Oh, she just keeps going. And then, and then, and then. Wait for it. Okay, this was the piece de la resistance, if I'm saying that correctly, because I'm not French. This was the, the class. That I did so the same box as I used for the um, the cracker and treat boxes, but I I, I made this for um, a teacher survival kit. <laughs> <laughs> and here's that cracker box again, that cracker and treat box die again right in there, and like fill that up with little tissues or something, and then we've got antibacterial spray, and we've got Tide stick, and cleansing wipes, and band aids. For all your favorite teacher survival <laughs> kits, right? And for your te for you teachers, for your friends, right? When they're starting. So that was the teacher oh. survival kit. And the, these all, the pencils all came from the Everyday Thanks. The apples all came from Apple Harvest. And uh, Give It a Whirl Die was also thrown in there. All going. All, all going. All going, so, yeah. Woohoo! 
I do have instructions for all of these. <laughs> Radiating stitches dies are actually in the online exclusive. That's, this is a question coming up here. Yeah. They're in the online exclusive, so they're not retiring. Online exclusives is a completely different um, list product yeah. line. And they, we don't even get a list. When they go, they're gone. But, I just yeah. found out one of the papers was gone. Yeah, you have to kind of keep checking you them. Gotta, you got to get those fast because some of them sell out really quickly and yeah. they sometimes they don't restock them. So it's like once they're gone, they're gone. Right. Okay, next. He's all that. This is a awesome oh, yeah. masculine. I'm sad. Thing. I had a ton of these and I, I don't, I think I had already put them away. <laughs> and I love the dye. The dye is all, all that dyes. It's another one before they had matching. It's, I absolutely love. This is one I just did as, for a challenge, and I used the dye, and I just <gasps> just add the texture oh, up I the love side. It. And I love the colors you did it's there. It's my masculine. I did that a, is definitely masculine. That's fantastic. I did a. It was a challenge we had to do and with the paper. Cord goes perfectly on there. And I did um, a masculine and a feminine one. So this is the masculine because I used the. I needed a masculine image, so I went for that dye. Um, so, again, this is another one that I absolutely love. This, because you are, we're always looking for something, you know, got to make something for the boys in the, in the group. And this was my go-to for a while on this one. Oh, that's another fun fold. Yeah. I like that. Isn't that kind of cool? we got a little stopper on the yeah. front. Yeah. Um, you know... So, just great masculine cards, the set. Anybody, you know, you get a uh, car fanatic, barbecue fanatic. It's, they're just, I, I'm going to miss this set. Oh, that's another good fun fold. Yeah, like and the, the dies specifically. I mean, look how simple that card is. And it's great. And it's just, it's perfect. This, oh, double. These, this one, so this was <laughs> mine. This is the one I designed. And then this is the one I made for swaps because I was like, I, I, I can't keep cutting all those little dies for like 20 different cards. So that's how I simplified it. And that, yeah. And there's that's actually a good way of showing, yeah. you know, showing how to step things up or step yeah. things down. In or down. Case. Yeah. That was, I needed to come like, all right, back it off, Linda. So that is, he's all that. All right. Coming up next on our retiring favorites is a stamp set called Enjoy the Rhythm. And I should have also brought out the Rockstar because yeah. they're both going. They're both going. And the Rockstar, I felt like they kind of yeah. went together. Those, I mean, they, they, they blended together. And so I have a bunch of really cute fun folds with this one. Travel Maker, right? That's I love so cute. It. I love it. This is an accordion. And Linda and I both have the photos for all of these cards on our blogs. Yep. So um, you can go back and reference them. And this one... Put its frame back together again. <laughs> Here, I'll throw on. I got okay. one simple one to add to the. Uh, the enjoy go. the rhythm. There we go. Stick in. Okay, so this is a theater card from my theater card class, and it's got the little. This is a nice little presentation That's to put cute. out, right? And this paper is staying. The sun. Oh no, no, yeah. No, I forget the name of it, but it's staying. But the rock stars are both going. Rock stars and enjoy the rhythm are both going. Yep. Also, that musical folder is going too. Yeah. So there's a little triple time. There's so many things I'm sad. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> and this one. Oh, that's cool. And the uh, the last one, I I realized after I pulled it, it this one's actually from the rock star, but uh, it's going too. So I'll just throw this out here. <laughs> this was from my circle Sneaking read in class. a few extras. Yeah. I'll just, you know. Just throw that right in there, because who doesn't love a good guitar wreath? You know what I'm saying? From your favorite music lover? <laughs> That's so cool. So is that guitar? So, Did you use that there? Actually, these are from the really? Rockstar. Really? Yeah, is. I know. They are very similar. That's why I was thinking. They kind of they, they really mix and together. match them together. And I thought I had another card in there. I made, um, and I, I pub republished it on Easter, but I made it. Last year, the Easter Bunny rock star. Yep. Like the Easter Bunny was playing the, the drums, drums and yeah, the guitar. Yeah, yeah. I Super thought I'd cute. put it in there, but I must have forgot. But anyways, so another one, another love that's going. <laughs> oh, thank you. So sad. Okay, so I have now next Nature's Print. And this has 
die that's die that's dying that's going to <laughs> um you see how i feel about all these it's like they're dying they're leaving um it is sad i mean I we feel like we want to thank it. them thank them for their service I know. thank them for all the joy they brought us and our the people that we've given our cards to yeah. this one just i loved the fonts you know just That's so pretty color. and look at all the different colors yeah. like this is very versatile yeah um no, no you see that these, the in, retiring in colors on that one. They're going bye bye. And bye pretty bye. and yeah, bye a bye reminder bye. that they're going and some stuff is already gone in the in colors. Yeah. Okay. Some I just they're just so simple. I love the starry sky. Yeah, those two. I I I never would have been like that's what I'm putting together. It make me sad to see that go. You know, and they just some of them just work so awesome. That's why I like doing swaps because sometimes like I never would have thought of right? that. Right, it is true. You know, so. I love it when Linda does swaps too. Because <laughs> here we go. <laughs> All right, that's nature's print, and I can't remember the name of the dies. It's nature something or other. Um, but they're all going. Bye bye. Next on my list of favorites is a bundle. It's a stamp set and die set, and it is also coincidentally what we're giving away today. And I, I have a used one in my hand, but you, <laughs> if you are the winner, you will be winning a new set. All you need to do to enter this giveaway is drop a comment, and we'll draw the winner on the next episode. But look at this die set, right? I love it. It's got build. It's got you know the build your own pirate ship. I, I I was all over this. So here's an accordion unfold. And I love it. Like the little waves, edgelets, they, that all came from the dies. You know, the little pieces in here all came from the dies. Oh, that's so cool. And then, oh, I don't even know which one of these to share first. They're both, they're both <laughs> wild cards. I, I just... I. I, I fell in love with that pirate ship as soon as it came into mm. the catalog. And after that, I was like, nonstop. Every class I had, I had that in there. <laughs> so this is the... Is that another theater card? It's a theater card that doesn't want to stay in its brain. <laughs> I'm going to have to come up Pesky. with... Pesky! I'm going to have to come up with a new class that has a card theater card stopper. <laughs> there we go. Yeah. Okay, so... No. Nor needs like pull yeah. tabs. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> All right, so when it's closed, right, it's got the clouds, got the, and then when it's open, Ooh. there's the surprise. You have pirates on board. <laughs> so so this is another theater card, and then um, this is <laughs> okay. So I love, I love, love, love this. <laughs> you I haven't think she said it enough. In case you ever noticed, I love it. Right? Ready? What? Oh, I love that. So this is the pop and twist. So there's a little surprise inside there. Open it up and boop. Yeah. <laughs> oh, so cool. So I have tutorials for all three of these on my blog, um, mm -hmm. on the blog post, linked on the blog post. But super fun set, and I'm very sad to see this one go. Mm. This is one of the ones I'll probably hang on to. Oh, um, like, I know. It's, it's hard to hang on to all of them because you've got to make space, right? Yep. But this one I think will probably stay in my collection for a long yep. time. All right. Here's... I, the builder, like, so, like, the one Tammy showed earlier, the ones that are, like, a builder mm -hmm. flower are big hits. So, this is the pansy patch, and it is going bye-bye, and I think it's just pansy dyes. Um, and here's another one I have a bazillion of, because everyone else loved it, too. You know, we got some fun, fun folds. This one. They just, they just, this is the paper that has retired, but they curled them up. Super cute. Great greetings. Lots of fun. I love like the I love these. Like I just love the building of the pansy. Lots of pansy lovers out yeah. there. So Anna says it's a heartbreaker. It, it is. is. Just you know, I I I'm sad about this one. Oh, and this. Hold on. This deserves it. Standalone Stand performance. Alone. This is Alice. Houston. Oh, this Alice. Alice, Alice made so this 3D box. Like, she's with so the awesome pansies. with the over the top. <laughs> you know, and like the flaps and 
There's more under the flaps. Yeah, that's a like, great. That was such a wow card. Yeah, so so that that needed its own space, but <laughs> bye bye to the pansies. The next bundle on Tammy's must-have retiring stamps and and products is the Sweet <coughs> Citrus bundle. I got some this of those. This is a stamp set. And it is not just a die set. I'm sorry, I don't have this open. I keep them taped now so they don't get separated from their loves. Mm -hmm. But it's um, it's a hybrid folder. So it cuts and it embosses. And, the, and that is part of the wow in the wowzers. So I don't even know where to start okay, with there. that. I've got, okay. I think this, this actually I, was a swap that I had. And then this was. That's cool. This one is from my um, swingers. Swing, <laughs> swing card <laughs> video, right? And that, that's just the the 3D folder there, and I colored it with Stampin' Blends. It's so cool. And then I did a floating floating frames class with it. Floating f with floating, floating frames, frames, which is really hard to say fast. <laughs> floating frames, um, you can actually make two in one cards, right? So yeah, you make, that's kind of make it's it. Built in. Yeah, you make it, and then when you cut the middle out, you get the middle, so you kind of get two at one time. So that's orange. Ah. This is grapefruit. <laughs> and this one's lime. Oh, so cool. So I got a couple to add. Make some more about there. Things. So we just got, I love the melon mambo. So it's like, this is your pink grapefruit. Oh, so pretty. And then just a simple yellow one. And then this one, oh no, this one. Okay, so this one, it's just got the little lemon on the inside. This, it's a fun. This is another good all occasion set. Yeah. I feel like you, you can use these for anything. We've got birthday greeting on here. I love a set that has all occasion greetings on it. And then it's got some fruits in there and some florals that you can pretty much just change any greeting on any of these cards. Yeah. And make it for sympathy, make it for birthday, make it for thank you. Yep. That to me that that's a great set to have in your collection. Okay. Oh, okay, so I think I got one last big um big one. And that is two tone floral. And of course the first one I'm looking at is like, why is this in the pile? <laughs> Hold on. There we go. Okay, I got some the must have two tone floral must have been married with some others that were just a greeting because some of these are just greetings oh so just the the two step stamping so you would stamp once with the lighter tone and then with a with a, a full stamp with the lighter ink and then the dark ink with the detail um to make the really absolutely stunning gorgeous flowers that we have here So pretty. And, you know, any color combination. And then another floral brings us back to that honorable mention. Yeah. I'm not sure if any of them are on this, but, you know, when you have a good floral set like this, pair it with a, a word set yeah. like Charming Sentiments that there has you all of your occasions in it, and boom. You know, so. <laughs> I have a bunch that just have words. It must have been a pair. So <laughs> that is two-tone floral. Okay, the next one. We may need to eat. We need to eat. <laughs> That's right. We're gonna. We're probably gonna eat it. I'm oh. probably gonna eat it. So it's Hello Ladybug. I know you're thinking what you're gonna eat a ladybug. <laughs> Maybe if I was in a, you know, there's certain <laughs> cultures that do eat bugs. I'm not one of them, but um, this one. Okay. I made little. Whoops! <laughs> throwing him around. Dive bomb. Made little candies out of, and then I've got these were like little lint bugs that were like little. That I added. Oh, the wings. The bees oh, on too. So cute. So yeah, I'm totally gonna eat that. <laughs> I've been waiting for this to retire so I could eat it. So I made um, a set. Actually, I made a whole thing, a whole class on different things you could do with that punch. And one of them was mouse ears. Right. <laughs> you got the big circle. You know, you can put it to put it together with um, the little circle with the big circle. So cute. And we had a hat set at one at time, time that yeah. I made that from. And so I had, this was my cheat sheet on how I made the different uh, mouse ears. Oh, so cute. And then, 
Mickey Mouse. Move him over here. So I get a lot. Okay, these came from swaps. There's one. And that's Oops, upside, upside down. down. <laughs> There's another one. This is a great simple. Oh, Ninja I love that one. Like that, the nice simple <gasps> one there. All right, so the rest of these are from my class. This one. You can bug me anytime. <laughs> Come on. How stinking cute is that? Stop it. And then I, you know, I, I got I got kind of crazy with the Google Eyes. Really loved playing with that. And then I've got uh, gold. The golden bug. <laughs> and then I've got another cheat sheet here on how to use the ladybug to make butterflies. Because, yeah, I mean, you can make butterflies out of ladybugs. It's true. There's, you know, three different or two different ways you can do it. So I, I have one card with the ladybug, and I can't find it. I did it on a live class, and so the pictures are on. We're going to show you a picture of a picture. Yeah. <laughs> the picture is right. on. This is my last one. It's an accordion bug. A little accordion love bug right there. So how sad is this? I'm going to show it on Facebook. So it, <laughs> there's know, a big, if you go cool to our, our our sites, you'll see it. Um, I made it on a live show. And so the, it opens like a ladybug. So I tried to make it look like a ladybug uh, top. But so that was my one. It is on our websites if you want to see it. And I think I forgot to link it to where I did the tutorial. But I will do that when I get home. But. I'm sad that I couldn't. I, I searched know, my entire card. Like, someone must have asked me for it. Or I had some birthday that it, someone loved ladybugs, and I was like, oh, I'll just use it. Not thinking at some point I'm going to desperately want the card back. <laughs> but, okay, so. Okay. Ready to do the zoo? Absolutely. All right. Absolutely. So we got the zany zoo. Because look at these guys. So the entire Zany Zoo is retiring the stamp set, the die, the paper. Tammy's eating the chocolate. I'm eating the bug. <laughs> this timber uh, folder, dynamic hybrid folder, is also retiring. These guys are just, they're too fun. They're too cute. You just, you can't not like them. They're perfect for just about any occasion. They're super fun. Like, I love that fold. Yeah. I like it. You know, make yourself a little stage. Put them out in the woods. You know. And the paper is the adorable. The paper. And then this the paper was, has them doing all kinds of fun things. You know, so. Tammy's got a bunch too. So I, um, these are double point uh, fun folds that I did with the, the Zany Zoo. And so they open and they've got cute little Zany Zoos on the inside. <laughs> I love a good fun fold. <laughs> and this is a joy fold. Joyful joy fold. So this opens and then this opens and then you got a whole lot of love inside. And the, I love the paper. The paper, you can see, I, you can tell. Right. When I love something, I use it a lot. <laughs> <laughs> and then I've got the accordion. Oh, so fun. These guys are going to be missed yeah, big time. Very sad. So that entire suite is going, and that is the zoo crew. Yep. Okay. I think next I got... <laughs> As someone was saying, it's finally sunny day into the southeast. We still have snow melting I from know. What happened? yesterday. We didn't get snow in the winter. We're getting it now. What the like, heck? Ur, waves of inspiration. This is one of those fun oh, sets that came out. This is another one that's been in for a little while, and I'm very sad to see it. I just, I, I... From the beginning, this had my heart. Yeah. You know, it's, some fun, simple cards. And then this was one I think we did when we did the scoop. Yep. Hold on. Which way did it go? Was that all? I thought that opened. Yeah, it does it, open. It does. Hold on. I think it does. Oh, you know, so I glue stuff. There we go. So it was this, 
And then this. That was it. I'm like, I had a... I know, we glue unique... it so we could take pictures of it. Yeah. I got to open that one too, but guess not. Okay. There's those. So the ways of inspiration I had... Um, this one's... Up. Yeah, you can look that up. Yeah. I, I had a couple of video classes that I did, and one was coloring with the blending brushes. So this one was uh, how to color with the blending brushes and a couple of techniques there, including like a resist technique mm. and... Um, I love some, that moon. Some masking. Some masking on that for the moon. And then I did a class on um, coloring with Stampin' Blend markers and some techniques with those. <laughs> <laughs> and then I've got just another. I think this was my original whale card, and then I think I turned it into that. <laughs> there's another one. This I just... I'm very, this one's another one. I'm very, very sad to see go. This was a swap card. I think Tina. Tina oh, yeah. Yep. Yep. Tina Wardell. And then we've just got the wave. The wave outline over the wave. Oh, I like that with the multi some, layers some, to some the wave. Yeah, this one's like a triptych. Oh, that's cool. And this one is an easel card. And this one was a kind of a fun fold here. Oh, that's Stood cool. Up. This is one of my classes. And then I put the, the birds and the, the clouds on the inside. That's really cool. <laughs> Wait, I know, right? We're going to be swapping back. I know. Like, I'll that. take this one. <laughs> I'll trade you this card for that one. <laughs> that is the Ways of Inspiration. Very top on our list. This one definitely would be... One of my top, one of my top sad to see yeah. those. And then the last one I Actually, have. I'm not going to lie, all of these are my top Thanks. sad yeah. to see goes. <laughs> That's why they made the cut. I know. <laughs> I think the, the last one we have, but I'm not sure I could be wrong, is Reach for the Stars. This was a good one. Kids, teens. Reach for the Stars is a fantastic There's set. always an adult who's really into the stars and whatever. So it was... Of something we don't usually have. Ruth wants to know what we do with our cards. Well, I give them away. I yeah. mean, once I, you know, I, I give a lot of them away. Yeah. But also, um, I use them for uh, my downline. Like, I, yeah. I put them together and do downline care packages. And they, you know, put the whole... Mine become my thank you cards. I have a whole stash that yeah. they move into the my thank you cards for my customers. So those are my reach for the, reach for the stars. Okay. Tammy's gone over and above. <laughs> All right, so where to start? <laughs> okay, this was a this was a simple one actually. It was the designer paper on the background. The rocks came from paper pumpkin kit. This was a paper oh, pumpkin that's alternate right, yeah. that I did, and the little astronaut jumping through space. And then these are some more of those double point cards. Upside down. <laughs> Be nice if I said hey, open it up, go. and you've got a you know. Cool little planets on the inside. You're stellar. So fun. And oh, where are we going? Okay, so this next one is coming to my blog on Monday. <laughs> she hopes it stays current. Until All right. Then. So we get, right, right. And the reason why is I made this card special for Monday. Oh, Maybe for you guys have heard, but there's an eclipse coming on Monday. <laughs> So I made an eclipse card, Happy birthday. <laughs> which is the name of the technique here. Yeah. It is the name of the technique of raising the letters on there. So this is a, a, a stellar eclipse birthday card. There so I'll have go. instructions for that on Monday. Stay tuned for that. And, oh, I don't even know where to start next. Okay, so envelope card box That's so with fun. the planets and the, we got a spaceship flying around in there. So cute. You can put a gift card in there. You can put treats on the inside. Lots of things you can do with these envelope card boxes. And then next, oh boy. Okay. We'll do this one next. This oh, is uh, the um, triple tier. And your, so your, your spaceship, like, your, uh, like a rocket, woo, taking off right there. So that is just all of another fun fold there, and last, but definitely not <laughs> least, and I shared one of these on my blog today for the a Paper Pumpkin alternate, it is a carousel card. Ah, and yes. Carousel cards are so fun. They also spin, 
So they're they're fun. Ah! They're not just fun to me in gift, <laughs> but they spin and they're really surprisingly easy to make. So that is my um, star burst star. Oh my God, I'm drawing a blank. Reach for Star the stars. Gazing. Star gazing. Star gazing. Re Reach for the stars right. is the stamp set. Star gazing is the sweet. And yes. these are um, some of my favorites from that one. The paper on this one, the the it is retiring. The sky paper is just really sad. Uh, that yeah. one, I I, re I wish they had kept that paper around. Yeah. The, but just the the starry sky is just fantastic. You can use it for anything. <laughs> wah, wah. I think that's all right, it. and I think that is our uh, show yeah. today. We only had a few cards. Yeah, you. just a I few. I hope you guys. Uh, I don't had know if you were counting, but tweak. I think yeah, I think we we, we were close <laughs> to hundred there. So these yeah. are all things that are retiring again. I can't stress this enough. No, no. Demo kit, best deal. If you're seeing things you love here. Uh, on the demonstrator kit right now, you can get any of these items, providing they're still yes. available and haven't sold out. And if you yes. wanted to, you could add pre-order items yeah. in that demonstrator only can get. You can get them in a demonstrator kit, and then you get future discounts. You don't have to really do any sales. It's you know, it's it, it's the greatest deal. It really yeah. is. So I highly recommend that. It's kind of like a club shopper. Yeah. You know, you join yeah. the club and then you get a discount going forward. And you forward. get a discount going forward. Yeah. And then you get to be in our stamp it group <laughs> and you get even more fun. All right, gang. So thank you so much for joining us today. And we will look forward to seeing you on the next Stampin' Scoop show. Yeah. Bye. Bye.